read this. Put on armor. Okay. Let's just wait here. Let's give it a few seconds. Do you see that? Guys? No way. No way. There it is. Guys? Guys? Oh my gosh! I'm freaking out right now. There's actually a ghost. Hey guys, this is Zork Camp 2. What did you do to the torch, mighty? So, we tried to get Mady's name tag back. Don't know how it actually got lost anyway. Um, but, uh, I don't know how it got lost, but, um, for whatever reason, we, we can't get Mady's name tag back. Um, so that's gonna be a bit of a problem, because now I won't be able to see where he is, like, if I'm looking for his name tag and he's, like, behind a wall. Um, that's going to be kind of, um, like, you know, problematic. Um, so this ghost here, if you'll remember him from episode 17, he's, um, he's not been doing much. Hey, buddy. Ah, turn glitch. Oh, I oh I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Um. Anyway. Uh, down to what we're doing this episode. Although, first things first. Noel, I was talking with him off screen lately, and he told me to ask Mady somehow he knew about him, if I had a name tag, which I obviously do, right? Yeah, you, yeah, you do. I do. Your can't too. Okay, good. Just checking, because he said something like, soon it might go away altogether, which I really don't um, want to happen. Anyway, guys, in this chest here, we have... Uh, took a while to make, right, Mady? Yeah. Took forever. But we finally made two full stacks of TNT and a, a few to spare. So I'm going to take one stack. Mady, you're going to take the other. I'm going to take this armor. Um, and actually, that... Hang on, I'm actually going to take this sword, too. All right, but... That's one of the problems, which is I have armor, and Mady at the moment does not. You think the ghost gives me any? Yeah, he's wearing some armor, and he doesn't really need it, because he wait, can just... Can, can he hear us? No, he can't hear us, but he can write on signs. Here, Here let, let me just... Yeah. Hey, can you give... Hello? Sorry. Hey, can you give Mady armor? Yeah, because he might. Like oh he my god, this is the worst time. St stupid players are... Oh, he's nodding. He's nodding. Wow. 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 Yeah, okay. Give Mady the diamond set. <laughs> <laughs> You're such an iron. Uh, karma, guys. Pure karma. Ghost is so awesome. <laughs> don't, 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 don't get feisty with him, okay? Because he does do that. Okay. Anyway... I'm just gonna tell him we're gonna go somewhere and we'll be right back. We'll. That's that. That's well. That's 
Well, we'll correct. be <laughs> right. We'll be right back. <laughs> That is weird. He's he's weird. Okay. Well, let's just go before something weird happens. Okay, I'm actually gonna cut this part out. Like, um, I'm gonna cut out the part where we're traveling to the second village where 9699's portal to the lab is most likely. Um, cause y you guys don't want to see us spending an eternity. J oh, oh, creeper. Okay. Anyway. You guys don't want to see us spending an eternity walking from one side of the world to another, so I'm just going to cut this part out. See ya. Okay, the stupid huskies... Alright guys, we're back anyway, but the stupid huskies are very annoying. Wait, I have this sword for a reason. Die. There we go. Okay guys, I think we're getting pretty close to the second village. Yeah, I don't have a sword. Yeah, you probably should have grabbed one. Oh wait, wait, wait! Dude, yield, yield. You what? see that thing up ahead? What? That that glowing stuff? Yeah, yeah. Hey, get down, get. Oh, dude. Looks like the village has been destroyed. Yeah. Okay, dude, Again? Dude, dude, dude. Let's go over here. Let's get over here. 9699 might 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 be over there. All right, dude. Dude, let's go around the back of the village. Yes, that's what I was thinking. Okay. 9699 could be there. So, we have to be very careful. Oh, that thing's huge. What thing's huge? That huge green thing. And there's creepers. Not a lot. So... Whoa! Oh! Look at- Oh! Dude, 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 dude! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! What? There's TNT everywhere. Where? I don't know, but it, it came from the village. Look out, look out. Dude, it came from the village. Okay, 9699 is definitely up there. Dude. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa. There he is! I see him! I see him! Dude, dude, oh. get down, get down, oh, get down! Oh. oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh! It's destroying everything. I know! Dude, dude, dude! You have to get down. Get down. He might see you. Where is he? Where is he? He's on top of the giant pillar. Wait, is that a portal? Yes. Wait. Oh, that... I, yeah, I can see a purple thing. Wait, you can? Yeah, I can see a purple thing down oh, there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I see it. I'm just going to keep hiding, okay? Cause... Oh, oh, he's moving. He's moving. He's moving. Oh, gosh, he's aiming at me. I don't think he knows you're there, though. Dude, dude, you have to shuffle up. Hurry, hurry. Oh, Dude, that is here. that is definitely a portal down there. Dude, that is without a doubt a portal to his lab. Dude, dude. Okay. Should I head for it? Where are you? I guess. Okay. I'm so scared. I think. Oh, he saw me! He saw me! He saw me! He saw me! I'm running! I'm running! I'm running! I'm running! Okay, What's I'm, he doing? I'm hiding in the village. I'm hiding in the village. What's he doing? I don't know what he's doing. Oh, what God, are those? That's scary. What what, what are those in his hand? I can't see him from where I am. Where are you? I'm right here. Ugh. Dude, I'm right here. Oh, okay, I see you, I see you. That snowball's in his hand. Oh no, I think he sees us, I think he sees us. He's shooting some kind of bow. Oh my oh, god! No, no. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh! Creeper, creeper! Last thing I want right now! Oh! Oh no, 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 Run, run, run! Oh, oh, wow, wow, wow! He just aimed right at us. Okay. He sees us. We gotta get to that portal, don't we? Yeah, we do. Oh my god, the lag. Wait, wait, dude. I don't think he knows that we hid in the house. Where are you? Or not, not hid in the house. Dude? Where are you, dude? Dude, 
I'm behind the furthest house. Furthest one? No, 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 no. Oh, God, it's really laggy. Where are you, where are you, where are you? Oh, no. He's aiming, he's aiming, he's aiming. Oh, gosh! Is that where you are? Please don't tell me that's where you are. Ah! Oh, he did another round! Oh, it is so laggy. Oh, my gosh. We gotta go, we gotta go. He came down to the ground, he came down to the ground. Oh, no. He better stop this, otherwise it's gonna lag me out. Oh, yes, he better stop. Wait, maybe maybe he's exerted all his power. Yeah, he must have, he must have, he must have. Oh, he shot one more time. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, one of the TNTs is right on him. It did nothing. Of course it did nothing. Dude, you really think he'd get ended by a piece of TNT? Wait, that didn't hit the portal, did it? Portal, like, the, the portal itself, like, is vulnerable. We have to, to, we have oh, to get dude. to the portal right now. I think he's stunned. He's not, go he's not moving, he's not moving. Oh, no, he sees me, he sees me, he sees me. He go. moved, he moved. Go, go, go. I think he's still a little stunned. Oh. Yo, what's that? Is that an enchanted barrier? Okay, no, I'm getting out of here. Go, yeah, go. Yeah, go, go, go. Go, go. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. Yes. Finally, it worked. Okay, so the minute we jumped through the portal, it took like, well, let's just say a, a long amount of time for me to actually get the recorder going again. Don't know why, but uh, in a nutshell, I have lost my flying skills. So, I don't know, but uh, we did notice this portal does look a little scary. Yeah, it looks a little weird. And what's down there? Also, uh, there is a very, very dark, creepy hallway that I just, it, you know, it's like those horror movies. Like, horror movie common sense. D just don't go down a dark, creepy hallway. Like, if, if you do, like, bro, what the heck are you doing? <laughs> You're gonna die. But should we go down this? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> <But see>? <laughs> <laughs> we'll defy horror. Okay. <laughs> nope. Oh my gosh. Dude, dude. It's not even bedrock. It's not even a bedrock wall. I don't even know what that is. That's like solid blackness on the other side. Dude. I, I can't walk through it. What? There's one block I can walk through. Dude. Oh my god. Okay, this is probably too dark for the viewers. The only thing they can see right now is that portal. I'm pretty sure if we jump through it, like all other 9699's portals, it'll probably just TP us back to the spawn. Yeah. But, yeah. We're not gonna do that just yet. Let me just say something, dude. This portal, like, and this creepy dark hallway, this is literally what creepypastas are meant to be. Like... I, I'm, I'm not saying, like, they're meant, like, they're meant to be like this. Well, yeah, I am saying they, they're meant to be like this. Dude, they are meant to be scary. They are meant to freak you out. Like, that's literally, like, it's even in the name. Creepy pastas. Creepy. They're logic. supposed to be creepy. They are logic. logic. Like, Herobrine was the first thing ever. Um, in Minecraft, like the first creepypasta, and like, like around the time he was discovered, everyone like there was like it it went viral. Like so many people were on Minecraft searching for Hero Brian. It was like insane, and Hero Brian was like it was freaky. Back then, he was just a creepy dude. Like creepypastas are meant to be scary. Um, there's one problem though, matey. Mm -hmm. How are we going to get through this blackness? Is there a hidden door? Maybe. Hey, I'm noticing a slight light over here. Wait. Wait. Th I went through. There's a... Wait. Oh my god. Dude. Wait! Oh my gosh! Wait, what? Oh! Oh my gosh. Dude. What's that? Oh my... Is that a... Matey? Is that a meteor? That's not a meteor. This is a giant sphere of structure blocks. 
This is what 9699 uses to power the XNXX world. Dude. Okay. I'm not sure if you guys... Like, I'm not sure if I've told you already, but my command squad... There's actually a few of them that actually helped me out with the creepypasta related stuff too. And a long, long time ago, when we were just starting to discover who XNXX was... We were like, okay, well there has to be some kind of reason... Why I'm, like, why, why a creepypasta, I was about to say man, why a creepypasta can, like, can have that much power to control something. Like, that, that's, that's what we were just, that's what we were theorizing. And I theorized, well, what about structure blocks? And then I immediately botched that idea, because I was like, back then it was like 1.2, and I was like, well, in this update, you can't really use structure blocks. Oh yeah, uh, matey, don't waste your time. Those are unbreakable. Um, but, um, so, dude, the 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 way nine six nine nine powers his world is through structure blocks. Think of it, dude. You need a ton of power to generate all those villages. This is probably how he did it. And there's like power, like there's power lines and everything. But look over here. That's what I thought was the meteor. And I don't know if I'm right, but it sure looks like what landed in the x next world a long time ago. Oh. Matey. I don't mean to freak you out, but you could be right. Wait a second. There's structure blocks inside this meteor? That's just like the one that landed. Oh my, yeah. Remember, we looked inside and there was yeah, a Yeah, yeah, yeah. We looked inside and at the very center there was a structure block. Wait a second, dude. I just realized something. What? Dude, wait a second. Double M joined the game. Okay, so as you guys could tell from the last minute messages up on up in the chat, uh, as we were trying to theorize what this meteor was, uh, the awesome moment gets awkwardly interrupted by Double M Wither. I mean, don't get me wrong, he's an awesome guy, but I mean... Bad timing. Yeah. <laughs> um, I mean, I'm not, tr I'm not trying to kick you out of this double M, but in a way, I kind of am. Like, I, I kind of don't really want other people to get involved because if 9699 does somehow, like, if you do start working with me on this, 9699, you may be put at risk of 9699 knowing who you are. And if 9699 knows who you are, that's not really going to be a good Minecraft anyway, uh, for dude. you. Anyway, dude. Anyway, sorry, Double M, but... What were you yeah. going to say? Um, well, where was I? You, you, you had a theory about what this was going to really do. Oh, yeah. Um, so that meteor that was in, like, episode 13, I think. Yeah. That was, like, nowhere close to as big as this. And that, like, that put a ginormous crater in the ground. I know, that, like, destroyed the whole area. So, dude, if... Think about what this could do. But if 9699 is building this with, like, 12 times as many structure... Probably, like, 20, actually. With 20 times as many structure blocks. Dude, think of how much damage that could do. Dude. This, that might actually, like, break a hole open into the void. I I'm serious. But, like, what's all this stuff around it? Like, these levers and pistons? Um... in place? I don't know. Um, I I'm probably kind of regret this, but... Whoa. Wait, it turned into glowing obsidian? Wait. Dude. Uh, probably shouldn't have done that. What about these ones? Dude, what are you doing? Dude, dude, I know what these do. I know what these do, okay? All I had to do was flip that lever. I know what these do now. Dude, don't flip any more levers, okay? Those levers build the meteor. And if you flip those last two levers, the meteorite is going to be complete. And 9699, the next time he walks into his room, is going to see the meteor is completed. I don't, e I don't think he'll even care if we, if we were here. The meteor will be completed once he launches that thing into the XNXX world. We are done for. 
the XNXX world itself is done for, okay? Where'd you go? I glitched. Okay, well, uh, um, okay, well, we're gonna be right back, guys. Okay, so I don't know what happens there, but maybe somehow glitched himself out of the lab and he fell underneath. And it was not pretty down there. Yeah, it was like some kind of creepy cave system, right? Yeah. Honestly, from the way you describe it, I was I would not like to glitch through the bedrock. Don't yes. even D don't drop to... a block on yourself, or you glitch through. The <laughs> okay, well, dude, um, we should probably turn these off. I think I have an idea as to how to stall him a little bit. Okay, dude, we have to break as much of this redstone as possible. Can he? <laughs> Actually, yeah, that could work. Wait, I have an idea. Since the redstone is already powered, just, um, just place it down. Uh, you, okay. Wait. All right, dude, dude. All right, start, start from the meteor. Start from the meteor and work your way down to the structure blocks. Ready? Why? Uh, cause, cause then you won't break the whole thing immediately. Okay, ready? Just place, place them near the redstone. Up. Oh. Wow, it's actually not doing anything. Good thing I have this handy dandy flint and steel here that I crafted before we started the video. Alright, lights out. Whew. Hey, that should stall him a bit. Oh! Dude, you're gonna die. No! <laughs> look out, look out! <laughs> Okay. okay, so I guess we did have a use for this TNT, but it wasn't as, it wasn't at all like we expected. Is there any more redstone over here? And this bedrock thing is in the way. You know, it doesn't matter. Um, what's important is that for now, the meteor is incomplete, and until 9699 repairs this damage, um, he's not going to be able to complete it, so that should buy us a bit of time. That actually worked a lot better than I thought it would. Oh my gosh. Guys, go away. Our sisters always get in the way of recording. But whatever. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Anyway, that should stop. Alright, through the creepy portal. Ah, uh, yeet. And glitch, and glitch, and glitch, and in it. So, yeah, it teleported us to our spawn. How predictable. I mean, after after two portals te teleport you to your spawn, it's pretty obvious that another one's going to do it, too. What are you doing? Bro, what are you doing? Complex Wedstone and the Neo. It's Complex Wedstone. High-quality content, sir. Um, maybe... So, when I recreated this world, um, I noticed the lava near the spawn is, uh... Kind of, kind of, um... You know what I mean? Yeah, it's all purple and green. That's kind of like the colors that was, uh, like the glowing obsidian, it's green. Wait a second, dude. If 969. Oh, I'm dead. Goodbye, world. Please tell me keep inventories on. Woo, baby. Wait. Oh, wait, the diamond armor protected you. Actually, yeah, that's good. Hey, dude, there's water right there. There's water right there. There we go. <laughs> you place a TNT. Here, hold something in your inventory that isn't placeable so that you don't accidentally place something. Okay. See, like, y you just placed the... Okay. <laughs> oh, and, and you placed one there. Yeah, you know, I'll, I'll get that. Yeah, no, never mind. Okay, so anyway, guys, that that's going to end it. But before it ends, I just want to say one last thing before maybe awkwardly... Dropped into the lava. I just got... I just got thrusted by a creeper. <laughs> no, no, actually, that isn't what I was going to say. What I was going to say is... Dude. First of all, the meteor itself is bad news. But... If he's 
if he's, like, moving on to building the meteor, does that mean he, like, think about it. Did he actually have time to build the meteor? Because, dude, if he did have time to build the meteor, then that means he completed the serum um creation, and that means that, um... Whatever it did is done? Yeah, that's not good. But what did it do? I don't know. Wait. Now I'm confused. Is the serum going to destroy the world, or is the meteor going to destroy the world? I think the meteor will change the world, and the serum will do something that might destroy it. Because if you've noticed when he's in this world, when he's like kind of in here, he's powerful, but like maybe he could be more powerful if it wasn't the way it was. Like it's just like the overworld. Just like oh, Shanana! I think I just realized what the serum does. So if you remember the, the ingredients that he put into the serum, there were five, like, super strength serums that were all golden. And there were five, like, super weird diamond totems that I don't think actually exist in, in like, the creative inventory. I mean, there's tons of things you can get from commands that you can't get from creative inventory, but still... I don't think you can get diamond tot like is there like a different data value for a totem that's a diamond? Anyway, dude, diamond totems must be super powerful, right? Mm -hmm. And he put five of those in the serum. So I think I don't think the serum is going to destroy the world. Um, this is going to make no sense, but I think it makes nine six nine nine more powerful. But it does make, like, zero sense because he's already so powerful. Like, why would he, why would he need to get more powerful? Like, couldn't, like, whatever he want to do, couldn't he just do it now? Instead of just have to get super powerful first and then... I don't know, dude. He's probably just trying to do something horrible with, like... Complicated stuff with creepy pastas. I don't know. Uh, I have another theory. Yeah. What if the serum has something to do with six, seven, eight, seven? How late is it? Oh, dude, it's, uh, it's 18. Alright. Hey! <laughs> what? What? Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> okay, so my theory. Okay. This is what I think is going to happen. We have two major threats of this world right now, which are the weird serum. Also that, actually three threats. We have the serum, we have the machine that he mentioned first thing in episode 11, which I'm still not quite sure what that does. And then we have 6787. No, we don't have 6787, we have something much worse. What? Uh, the meteor. Oh, yeah. Did you forget already in like five minutes? No. <laughs> so, yeah, the meteor is definitely going to do something horrible if it is launched into the sky and then it comes crashing down on the X and X, X world. Hey, dude, uh, what if it, what if, um, what if the meteor, 
What if what if it crashes into the second village? Hope not. That would be hilarious, cause dude, the second village, like that's kind of like where everything happens, and that's where nine six nine nine, um, was last known to know where I where our base was. Like, that is the last known location to nine six nine nine where we last were. So. Um. Also, it's been uh I don't know if you've acknowledged it, but this episode when we found it, it was like completely wrecked. And 9699 was just launching a giant arc of like giant arcs, <coughs> excuse me, of TNT everywhere and it was kind of scary. But it obviously wasn't that bad. Like it was just Maybe yeah. He's doing something else. Will he look for our base, maybe? Probably. You know, that's act- yeah. that, that actually makes sense. So he, he could have found it while we were there, but I don't know. We might, I, I guess we're safe for now because he's not here now. No, he's um he's still in the second village. Dude, I think I know why he's um doing it. You probably already answered this, but I'm not sure this was your exact answer. Dude, I think he still thinks that we set up our base in the second village. But he knows now that we're smart enough to put it somewhere hidden that will take him longer to find. So he's he's looking underground underneath the village. Now, if he looked underneath the village in the fifth village, he would be right. But uh, he doesn't have to know that, dude. He, he doesn't have to know that, okay? okay? In fact, we don't want him to know that, because if he does, then uh, we're kind of um, scared. Scared. Okay, so that's the end of the video. We have lots of problems. Yeah. Nothing got any better. We were trying to destroy 9699's lab. And in fact, he already got angry. Uh, he, he got, so, uh, we wanted to see him angry. And it worked. But he got angry before we even entered his lab. And we weren't able, we weren't even able to destroy anything, in, well, we were able to destroy the redstone. But we were looking for something to, like, full on destroy. And we were only d- able to destroy part of what we found, which is the construction of a possible doomsday meteor that he is probably going to launch anytime soon after he finishes it. Uh, which is going to be very, very problematic. But yeah, so that was the video. Yeah, that was the video. So I hope you enjoyed. Um, like and subscribe if you enjoy Mady's derpiness. Hey, Mady, show me your derp face. Yay! There we go. <laughs> okay. So yeah, we, we 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 gotta stay happy when we're fighting evil giant weird creepy pastas, cause that's how we can stay sane, right, Mady? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Well, anyway, it is getting uh, pretty dark in Minecraft, and it's also getting pretty dark in real life, so we should probably end this video now. Uh, goodbye.